Hello, I'm Holly Biller with Window Film Magazine bringing you this special report on films. Following the recent news that Eastman Chemical Company had entered an agreement to acquire Commonwealth Laminating and Coating, editor Casey Neely went down to Commonwealth's headquarters in Martinsville, Virginia. There she spoke with Steve Phillips, the company's president and CEO. We have Casey on the phone with an update. Casey? Hi, Holly. I was able to speak one-on-one -on -one with Steve Phillips, who, while unable to comment beyond what was stated in the company's press release, did say that he is excited about the sale. When asked what his plans were, he indicated that he plans to stay with Eastman after the closing and focus on the merging of the two companies. Phillips also reinforced the point that he felt the deal would be good for both employees and customers in the long term. And when I saw employees around the office, they seemed upbeat and told me it was business as usual. Travis Smith, Vice President and General Manager, Performance Fills for Eastman, released the following statement. This acquisition will allow Eastman to gain efficiencies through enhanced utilization of manufacturing assets. It will also enable Eastman to better serve the window and protective film's broad and diverse customer base while complementing our strategies to increase consumer adoption and use of window films globally. Eastman is fully committed to providing continued superior service and support to customers worldwide as we successfully integrate these two businesses. That's all for this special report. What are your thoughts on the deal? Email window film editor Casey Neely and share your comments. Stay tuned to our website for latest updates as the acquisition develops. Thanks for joining us.